Forget Lewis versus Jensen. The ultimate fight for motoring supremacy has always been the eternal battle between the sexes. Are lads better drivers than ladies? <sighs> now, as women know that there is no contest, but we need to prove it. Welcome to Seat Sex Drive in association with Fifth Gear. <laughs> Leading this epic battle of the sexes are celebrity team captains, adrenaline junkie Jack Osborne. and model and TV presenter, Emma Willis. I am sick to the stomach with the testosterone fuel drivel that men spout about being the better driver. So, I'm planning to go and find four very ballsy chicks who will prove once and for all that women are number one. We all know men become one with their machines. We're born with that instinct. But what I'm looking for is for four men with the power, the passion, and the skill to take this challenge on. Men truly will come out on top. From the thousands of people who have joined our Facebook recruitment campaign, only 300 of the very best have invited down here to the ProDrive test track. Three nerve-wracking challenges have been specially created to find the drivers with the skill, the speed, the precision and the technical ability to make it through to the final. First up, cops and robbers. The robbers are tasked with dropping off six swag bags at various points in the circuit without getting caught by the charging cops behind. The cops have to stop and pick up the abandoned loot as they go. And there are a few surprises along the way. I don't think that's the best way of doing it. The wheel's over there. The wheel's the over there. Next, we're heading off the track and to the pit stop challenge. Each team will be confronted by a partially stripped down Seat Leon and an instruction manual. And their job is to put it back together and then drive it out through the garage door within 60 minutes. Have you got them in? It's clicked in. And final audition challenge is stunt driving. Reverse J turns, handbrake turns, swerving at speed, and braking in wet, hazardous conditions. Our lads and lasses will have to perform each manoeuvre with as much style and grace as they can muster without hitting anything. Getting through to the Seat Sex Drive finals isn't all about on-track results and scoring points. The ultimate decision lies with our celebrity team captains. It's got to be a healthy balance between having a really good competitive attitude you know, and being a good driver. I'm looking for confidence, charisma, but the main thing and the most important thing is somebody whose ambition is in life to be a winner. Let's see who got picked. Andy Morgan. Yeah. It's been a great day out. I've enjoyed myself. It's nice to come and give somebody else's car a bit of a thrashing. Catherine Johnson. Best event of the day, cops and robbers. Definitely cops and robbers. Adam Routledge. Sarah Tom. Mr. James Dean himself. I had an amazing day. I was completely gobsmacked when they uh, called my number out at the end. The highlight of the day for me was definitely the skid pan. I've always wanted to do that. Best event tonight is a toss up between the stunt driving and the cops and robbers. Sakina Fotheringham. Ben Ribka. Whoa. Yeah! Sue Whitmore. <laughs> I like cops and robbers. I enjoyed the fact that you could accelerate really fast, go into the bend, and then just really floor it. I didn't think they were going to call my name out. Uh, I've not really come to win. I've come to enjoy myself, thrash the cars about. I did beat the person I challenged today, which was my husband, so yeah, he'll be doing some dog walking, I think. <laughs>
If you thought it was hard going so far, it gets really tough for these eight lucky drivers. The Seat Sex Drive final involves five specially devised, fiendishly difficult driving challenges that lie ahead. And there's more, because the winning team will have the chance to race for Seat UK in a round of the famous Brick Car Championships. Plus, anyone supporting either teams via Facebook will be put into a prize draw to win Shakira concert tickets for the ladies and for the blokes, tickets to the 2011 Europa Cup to be held in Dublin. And when we finally establish which is the superior sex, there'll be a nasty forfeit for the losing team captain. So stay tuned to set Sex Drive to find out who will triumph in the battle of the sexes.